What's up guys? So today I'm going to be showing the clearances I have uh, when flexing the Jeep a little bit here. Don't have the greatest, um, you know, way to test this. This is the best I got. Uh, it's not too bad actually. But uh, anyway, so I wanted to show you, so this is on 35 inch tires with metal cloaks overline tube fender system. So I have the mod cut in the rear and then just their standard uh, uh, overline tube fender up front. So up front, I already made a video on this earlier and uh, I got plenty of clearance up here. I really don't have to worry a whole lot. Um, and as you can see, I still got some um, room for the bump stop to hit the axle there. So, and I still have, so this could actually flex a little bit more obviously. Um, and I still think I'll be just fine up front. So we'll go to the rear on the other side and I'll show you guys. Sorry if I'm breathing a little heavy, it's minus three degrees out today. So it's a little, a little cold. So as you can see, got plenty of clearance up top. Just the only place I start having issues is coming back to the rear here. Now, as you can see, the mod cut area is right here. So this is the top of my Jeep that I can just cut. So I can just cut this away and give myself, you know, that extra space. But as you can see now, I am touching there. And I am touching just a tiny bit up here. So same idea. I can cut this back a little bit to give me more clearance. Um, as well as adding, I can add some... A bump stop like extender pieces just little pucks that sit on top of the the axle so i basically just kind of limit my suspension travel a little bit so yeah this obviously isn't the greatest off-roading setup but i think i'll be able to have a decent amount of fun with it um there's really not too many off-road places around here which is kind of a bummer so we'll hopefully in a little bit here, we'll try to find some uh, trails that we can just go drive on with my buddy. He's got a Jeep too, so we'll just go with him. But uh, but yeah, so this is kind of what 35s no lift with metal close kind of looks like and what you can kind of expect as far as clearance wise. So the nice thing is, you know, I can always just cut a little bit more of the Jeep um, to get more clearance. But I'm really happy with how the, the fronts are. The fronts are, have just plenty of space. So... But uh, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up. Definitely consider subscribing. That helps me out a lot, guys. And uh, I'm going to go inside and warm up. So I'll see you guys in the next video.